Okay, y'all, I saw this actually on Pinterest. I was like, hey, I have an avocado, I have strawberries, and I have some sourdough bread. Also this glaze. So I wanted to give it a try. It's definitely something different for me. Um, ooh, y'all, that look good, doesn't it? So this is sourdough, y'all. I keep mine in the freezer just because I don't go through it as fast as other bread. Avocado oil and some garlic. Okay, y'all. So I did decide that I'm gonna use avocado and I'm gonna use a little bit of cream cheese. So I got this from um, my local grocery store. I've never had this particular brand so i'm excited to try it let me know down in the comments below if you had this one and how you like it okay y'all so i did put a little bit of this butter on my toast okay we're gonna call this one a trial and error test toast okay test toast y'all this avocado looks so good it's huge for a shot so this is what I'm gonna take y'all I've been avoiding <laughs> trying to open this one because it's apple pie and I don't like the real apple pie so um, yeah so let's just see how this one tastes okay y'all <laughs> you already know cheers to get out I was really nervous about apple pie. Hmm, not bad. So we have our vegan cream cheese. This actually had, I didn't realize it had chives in it. So I'm gonna put this on there for a little bit more razzle dazzle. Cheers to good breakfast. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. <laughs> mm. Y'all, yeah. cream cheese and chives, avocado, strawberry, balsamic glaze, <laughs> baby. Well, that's really good. Listen, I could taste the garlic and all right. Ooh, y'all, Pilates was kicking my butt today. Okay, but I enjoyed it, y'all. I love me some Pilates. I can definitely tell that it's built up my muscular endurance and my strength, y'all, and that flexibility come through because, y'all, I was struggling. Um, and it's definitely helped me develop a core strength. I wish y'all can just, okay, that's not my core, but y'all get the point. It's getting there, okay? Slowly but surely. Now these little boxes, y'all, y'all see this box. Why do I always, look at this. <laughs> I always feel like a little fish or something trying to come up out the water because anyways, I was trying y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and let y'all finish watching the rest of this workout before we get to lunch, but definitely try Pilates. It improves your posture too, y'all. It improves your posture. Okay, y'all, so 
so it's time for lunch. This has been sitting in my pantry for a couple of weeks. So, so it's about time for me to actually try it. Um, this is the Rotini noodles. It has spinach, zucchini, broccoli, parsley, and kale. Um, so I'll get all my vegetables in in this dish. the light make it a little better can you see there it is shouldn't take very long to cook so apparently this was made I think in Italy but it's it's homemade all natural um, 120 years in the making y'all has been around for that long and I'm just finding out about it on TikTok. y'all this is cheaper than buying a flight to Italy so I'm excited to try this. I see it all over TikTok. I'm gonna add a little bit of Parmesan. You can do nutritional yeast. Y'all, it smells so good in here, but check it out. Look at this. Oh. Baby. Y'all. Why book that flight to Italy? No, book that flight. <laughs> but if you want a little taste of Italy, this, y'all, I see why it's all over TikTok. I wish I would have known about this many moons ago. Mm. Okay, y'all, that was a nice little walk run, but I am hungry per usual. So I wanted to show you guys my latest like snack obsessions outside of smoothies. Y'all, no one told me about these. No one told me about these. I happened to go into the grocery store and I'm going down with my little cart trying to find some cereal or something. Oatmeal, oatmeal, that's what it was. And I was like, wait a minute, we know Dave's killer bread. I was like, what is this? So here's the box that it came in. Here we go. 22 grams of whole grains of sense. Like, mm, it's so soft. I keep one of these in my purse. We all know about popcorn. My husband put me on these, I don't know, a couple of weeks ago, a month ago. Spicy queso? Yeah. I think this, these are the alternatives to Doritos. These are good. Yo, I eat this whole bag by myself. Y'all, it's like one, you have one, you gotta have a whole bag. Period, okay? Just work out. That's what I do. Okay, y'all, so this is something I saw on TikTok and I wanna try it. So that's what we're gonna do. Um, they call them dumplings, however, they're just like spring rolls to me. So spring rolls, dumpling to eat their own. Here is everything. These are linked in my Amazon storefront if you're interested. Well, that was fast. Okay. And we're gonna mix this together. We don't want it to be super soggy, so not like all the way cooked. Sesame seed oil. Rice wine, vinegar, just a little bit. Coconut amino.
definitely learned some things so the paper like sticks right so when I put them all in the pan to sear they started sticking together so that's why mine are like shaped uh oh let me take this off shaped a little funny y'all but that's okay they're still gonna taste good I'm gonna put in a little bit of this dumpling sauce oh yes oh look at Please try this one too. <laughs> I'll say that about everything, except when it comes to blueberries. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. I'm Jay Maxine. Don't forget to like. It helps your girl get a little farther into the algorithm. Comment because I love to chit chat. Get some ideas and definitely subscribe because I want you to stay. Y'all, we are growing, okay? It takes a village. See y'all next week. Bye guys. Bye.